Time for some pillow talk now. Colleen hasn't enjoyed any for a while. Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh. A new study has revealed that more than a quarter of us can't sleep without a regular pillow, with a fifth even taking theirs on holiday. Janet, I cannot believe that you would get upset about something as silly as a pillow. Well, for the last two nights, I've had the best night's sleep in a year, and it's because I changed my pillow. Yes! <laughs> now, I've got this theory that your head's very heavy. Uh-huh. Right. June's agreeing with yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. And it's because some of us have got very big brains in there. No, I'm only joking. <laughs> um, my head was at a funny angle, and I was always waking up after two hours, and then I'd go in the bathroom, have a quick wee, take a headache pill, go back to bed, and that has been the pattern of my life for a year. And then uh, my partner, who I don't really listen to 90% of the time, <laughs> after he'd said it about 45 times about change your pillow to a big, high pillow, I thought, I'll give it a go. I've got one. Different shape. It's Well, to be frank, it looks a bit like a tombstone, but, I mean, <laughs> it's heavy and it's rectangular yeah. and really, really heavy. And when you put a head on it, it looks like a building block or something in the bed. <laughs> and then you just sleep. Yeah. Now I'm going to be carrying it round everywhere I go. In fact, I'm going to have to spend more money and get, you know, two or three of them. But you're, you're obsessed with them to the point that you ring a hotel, is that right? Yeah, but some hotels have pillow menus. Which I never, ever knew. Did I you know, know that. that. These <laughs> things are fancy that. places. Yes, I'm sorry, the audience I'm obviously <laughs> staying in better places never than you. I've never ever heard of a you, pillow what menu. About me, I, I do exactly what Anna does, yeah. I really do. I sort of uh, have a big square pillow and, and I also have it on an angle. I have, a, I have one at the back behind it and yeah. I say a little prayer when I go to sleep, you know, I do all sorts of funny things and, and as I do all this... <laughs> I decided I'm compulsive. What's that thing that you are obsessive yeah, about? Obsessive, yes. I'm obsessive, yes. You've got a little ritual. Do you have a ritual? Yeah, yes, better? I have everything a ritual, but I've stopped worrying about it. I only realised it today and I needn't really bother. <laughs> so I pull it down and, so I, and that's very good for your breathing as well. Yes. You see? Yeah, yeah. You, you, cos you, you, if you lie flat, you could get pneumonia. Yeah, I'm mm. very partial to that. <laughs> <laughs> Do you, uh, do you ever wash your pillow, June? Because apparently ah. you're supposed to wash your pillow. I <gasps> Are didn't you? know that. Yeah, yeah, you're yes. supposed to wash your pillow. Well, mine is down. Oh, <laughs> and oh it's so rather can't. difficult to wash. You can mm. hoover it. <laughs> and have you tried that? You don't want to think of all those little bugs that no. are right. No, no, don't no. think about it. Just keep it to one side. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Anyway, I do what you do. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. No, I've got a very, very volatile relationship with my pillows. Oh. Yeah, I can have a volatile relationship Honestly, with your pillows. Honestly, I row with my pillows every night. We need counselling, me and my pillows. <laughs> What's happening? It, they just annoy me. So if I've got two, it's too high, so I take one off the top and then it's too flat. Yes. And then every time I turn around, I have to rearrange the pillows, so that keeps me awake another night. And <laughs> yeah. I don't take... And then I think, oh, I'm in a hotel, I'll, it'll be nice, I'll have good pillows. And then I get there and row with them. Me and pillows just don't like it. Just don't get on. <laughs> I've got to have one, one, at, one at me back and one between me legs, as the actor. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. So, I mean, I've got me one, I've got me cushion here, actually, which they've just brought for me because of me nana back. So I've got that going on, but I have to have one between me legs because apparently if you've got yeah. bad lower back, you've got yes. to balance yourself out. So I've bought... A pregnancy pillow, which is one of those that are like that, yes. so you can sort of put it behind your back and squidge a bit between your legs. Then I've got to hide one oh my because my because Lincoln God. is pillow obsessed, and because I snore like a warthog, if if <laughs> that makes a noise, I think. Oh, a, Lincoln's a lucky Lincoln man, a lucky isn't man. he? Uh -huh. He's a lucky man. He sometimes has to leave me rather than push me and kick me out the bed. He will go into the into the snoring room, but he's like a pillow thief. So if I wake up, I see him trying to pull the ones from out of me and walking you up with them what? all over. Can I just mention the snoring room? It's interesting you say that, because at the weekend, when I was sleeping really, really well on my pillow, I woke up on Sunday morning and I thought, in our spare bedroom, I could hear this terrible snoring and I went in and it was the dog. <laughs> <laughs> and the dog had rearranged all the pillows on the bed. The dog's certainly got a relationship with the pillows because yeah. he now thinks it's human. The dog was lying on his back snoring with his bits on full display. <laughs> oh, God. It was a horrible yeah. sight. My dog is my pillow. That's what I use as <laughs> my pillow. Um, 
Here's another one for you. Apparently in Switzerland they have introduced a cinema which has double beds instead of the regular sort of seats. <laughs> June, what do you think? And sheets, June. They have yeah, beds the with full sheets. Thing. I'm sick and tired of sex, I really. <laughs> Did you get fed up with it? Oh, about 20 years ago. <laughs> <laughs> That's still quite a good innings, though, isn't it? Yeah. That took you to be, what, 70 72. Foot, 72? Yeah. 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 You, you, your maths I've got a good 12 well. years, Lincoln. <laughs> 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 Only oh, if you remove that pillow. I think it's a really weird idea that you're so desperate to get under the sheets with someone you have to uh, book a cinema ticket. Oh, I mean, sorry. really. Oh, it's I... so public, isn't it? Oh. I know, and I wouldn't like to be in the next bit. Oh, no, I don't <laughs> I like, like it. I would like to listen to the noises. Usually it's just well, popcorn. I don't think it's and... for that. I don't think they've opened the cinema for people. No. What do they think just... it's going to be I for? Just... Well, if it was Janet, really bring them up and say, I want to see the five o'clock show. Can I see your pillow menu, please? <laughs> <laughs> At the local cinema. Oh, no. <laughs> I think we're saying no to them, aren't we? I don't Horrible know. I quite idea. like it. You quite, like, I quite it. like it. You just like being on your back. And I don't mean that. I, don't, I didn't mean it like that. Oh. Honestly. Hey, Come on, back me up. Back, June, honestly, Absolutely. I'm not being offensive. Well, I, 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 I'm not backing you off on that. It's a horror. <laughs> June, thank you very much. June, everyone. <laughs>